Well, this is the unboxing of Boardwalk Empire, the complete second season. Now, as you see below, that the, it obviously was used, but they, I, that's what I hate about used stuff is that they put all these markings on everything. But there's nothing you can do about it. And um, got another back. See, there's a barcode. You get, you get what you get. We'll go through the set, and then we'll show you how bad they do on the DVDs. One of the sets didn't even come with DVDs, debating whether to, what to do with it. Even though um, I don't really need DVDs anymore. Okay, so we got five discs, and you can look in the backgrounds, and you can see what they look like. They got a little episode guide over there, which isn't really a big deal. Now, this disc is pretty much flawless. A little couple of couple of marks on that. And that's just disc is um. Yeah, that's pretty much excellente. Then you look at the third disc. Now the reason why is there's a little mark up there. Not a big deal though. You always have to do a disc check. Even though a, a actual disc check is better if you were to fast forward through all of them. That's how I pointed out all those Game of Thrones errors. But when it's something that's only about like 10, 15 bucks or a little more than that. It's not worth going on a television for hours and look staring at it. Well, there's not really much to say, except these discs are all in pretty good, damn good condition. Anything that I've seen is fingerprint smudges. And the discs usually play with the, with, with those. Okay. There's more. See, there's more of the background. And there, there, and there. Okay. So, that's for that. And the other thing that popped out of the box was the DVDs. Now... When you buy it used, you get this. This is what the digital copy looked like. There's no digital copy that came with this one like the other one I had. I got lucky with that one. Um, yeah, it tells you when it was done and all that crap. That's what was in the box. It's actually a smart place to put it. Then you got this. Yeah, like I said, they're impossible to get out when they haven't been taken out in years. Alright, it's gonna... Actually, these DVDs are better than the other ones. Somewhere in tear. Not that bad though. The only way to tell what what disc you're on is to basically um look at the black going around it. That one, this one's a little more used, and you reverse it. But overall, they all look like they're in workable condition. But looks can be deceiving. Okay, so that's that for that. Make sure I put this back in there. I'm debating whether I should get another copy. I don't know if I should. Um. Let's just say that that'll be that. All right, um, yeah, bye bye.